Good morning, I'm Mary Ellen, and today I'm just gonna share with you some things that I've been enjoying, some things that have been helping out, and the results of my sleep study test. And before I get started with all that, I wanna share something with you. I had a lot of questions on my last video about if I was gonna buy the neck and decollete and hand mask, and I'm not going to, but for me, this is what is gonna be good enough. If I turn the mask on, and put my hands right here, which you know I'm not gonna do it, but if I wanted to, I know that it would help my hands. Here's all the lights on the mask. If I wanted to lie back and put this on my neck, I know it would help my neck. And the same thing about the chest, I may have to reposition it, you know, to hit all the spots, but for me, this is good enough, and I'll let you know if I ever decide to do anything but my face. But I am down to four days a week. I'm taking off Wednesdays, so it's still working out real well. And I am going to change up my skincare a little bit, but I'm still working on that. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. I am not big at all on Instagram. I do have an Instagram. It's Mary Ellen After Six, I believe it is. And I don't, I very seldom use it. I have used it to put out some messages uh, when I needed to, and they were I just not very good at it. But at the very top of Instagram, they have something I think called stories, they're little circles. And I have been loving watching Laura Ray, over 50, dance on the beach with her husband. I, I just, they've been married 39 years, and they are dancing on the beach, and I am going to put her handle below. I don't know how to link to Instagram, but it is definitely worth your time. If you, if you want something that just makes you smile, I'll give you just a tiny taste. There you go. There's, there's Laura Ray dancing, and her husband's going to be joining her in just a second, and they truly are a joy to watch. I would play the music, but I would get a big old strike. Funny story, you never know who's watching you or who's going to be watching you. But one time when I was talking about my daughter and son-in-law's new kitchen, I was mentioning about how she liked her air fryer and how, like, how she cooked for so many people. Well, her husband was watching that day, and he said, you tell your mom that I do a whole lot of the cooking, and he does, so I thought that was funny. And my son Jeremy's youngest son is finishing his senior year, and I watched him play football all fall online, and I've been able to watch him play basketball when it's live streamed, and I have loved every single minute of it. I told him he's the only person that keeps me up past seven o'clock. <laughs> I have very few things. I've, I think I've got four things that I'm gonna talk about that I bought, and they're very practical things. And one of them is a food, and it is onion and bell pepper, and it's frozen. I like when I do stir frying things like that, I want my vegetables a little crisp, but Jim doesn't. But when I do omelets, I like to have them a little bit softer. This has made omelet making so easy. You know, I'm a slacker, and when Jim wants an omelet, all I have to do is put a little butter in the pan, put some of these frozen peppers. I don't have to chop, I don't have to clean. It's just so easy to do, and I can whip up an omelet in five minutes. So these have been very, very helpful. I bought them on a whim and I've repurchased them. That's how much I like them. Those who've been with me a while remember when I suffered from cold feet and cold hands. It was a medication that I was on and my feet were so cold. That's when I started buying Uggs, Ugg shoes. I got boots, I have slippers. I absolutely love them. Even though my feet aren't as cold as they used to be, I just really love the Uggs. Well, I have a pair of boots that aren't Uggs. They're like house shoe boots, and they just weren't getting it. And I looked online to see if I could buy an Ugg insole, and you can. They're like $20. I got these from Amazon, and they're wonderful. I had to trim just a little bit off so it would go right down into the shoe. But my shoes are a size 10, and these are a size 10. As long as you have the room for the thickness, and I did, I just absolutely one of my favorites. Okay, this is my long story, and I'll, I'll put a little thing when this is over. I have known for quite some time that I've had sleep disturbances, that I probably have sleep apnea, 
but I didn't want to go in and have a sleep study test, so I kept putting it off and putting it off and putting it off. I wear my Apple Watch to bed, and I also wear a Fitbit when I sleep, so I know exactly what my sleep looks like. I can compare both of them, and I, and I knew I was having problems. Of course, I did everything I was supposed to do. I don't eat after like three o'clock in the afternoon. Uh, there's just a lot of things that I don't do that I, that I thought would help me. I tried the sleep and glow pillow because I thought the way your head could go back, that would help, but I, it was never ever comfortable for me at all. So I thought, well, I'm gonna get some of these X's. I don't know if you'll be able to see them or not, but what you do, you put them on your mouth from here to here, and it makes you breathe through your nose. So I tried that, it didn't work, but the good thing, the brand that I bought, they I think they were $10 for 90 of them or $9.99. They did not disturb my skin and make it red. I've tried other things on my face like those. Years ago, I tried those things for your 11s. Oh, it, it um, made my skin so red it wasn't worth it. So I thought, well, I'll try these. And, and they did work, but it did not help my sleep. The next thing I did was I bought a wedge pillow and I'm very pleased with this. And it was recommended to do a seven and a half inch lift. Well, I ordered it, I, it was $35 and I've been really pleased with it. The first thing I did, I took the cover off and I washed it and I hung it to dry. And I really can't show you much of it, but this much of it is memory foam. And here is, and this opens up and it's real easy. And it's easy to put the case back on. I wash everything before I, even a washcloth before I put it on. I just wash it because you never know what's been on it. This looks horrible, but this is what I put on it. I put a little half pillow and I just put it on right there. And that way I still have my silk and it just raises my neck just enough, but it didn't. I thought maybe it would cure what I believe to be sleep apnea. Well, lo and behold, I had, a, I had an appointment with my cardiologist and he said, I really think you need to have a sleep study. And I was thinking, well, okay, I'll do that. I did not know you could do them at home. So I was given the choice. Do I want to drive an hour and spend the night at a facility? Or do I want to do the at-home test for two nights? And I did the at-home test for two nights. You could wear this ring on, on your thumb or on your finger. And yes, I do have sleep apnea and I'm gonna be getting a CPAP machine. So I'll let you know how that goes. The next time I do a video, a chit chatty video, I'll probably be asking for suggestions if I need them. Because One of my viewers, Who's Your Mama? She said she does the 478 and I tried it. I don't have trouble getting to sleep. It's waking up, oh, so many times through the night, it's not even funny. But if you have trouble going to sleep, this might help you. She says you breathe in slowly in your through your nose for four seconds, you hold it for seven seconds, and you exhale for eight seconds. And she said five or six times, I think is what she said, it relaxes her enough that she just goes to sleep. So I wanted to share that with you. Something else I wanna share, and again, you've gotta do your research. I did my research and it paid off. Mark Cuban has a pharmacy. Mark Cuban's a billionaire, and he wanted to help people that needed help with pharmaceuticals, and it's only generic. There's nothing, there's a huge list. Well, I take dofetilide, and what I paid $477 for, I got through Mark Cuban Pharmacy. It's called Cost Plus. And I, I won't put a link, but I'll put the information on the screen or below. What you did, what I did is I went in, I looked up my medication, and it told you what the price was. So I printed the form, I filled it out, and when, and what I, when I went to my doctor, I gave the nurse the form and just said, check it out, see what you think. And I got it for $44, I, I couldn't believe it. I still use my local pharmacy, not for an expensive drug like that. I mean, it, it there's no middleman and it's all generic. So if that helps one of you, I am happy because you know what? It makes me happy when I can help you because I know that there's so many problems out there. I'm trying to get another discount code for you all. And for me, for, for my, from the, one of the major online shops, they contacted me and offered me a 15% discount and to give to my viewers. 
and I'm trying to get it a little bit better. So if I get it, I'll put it, I'll put either the 15% discount code below. Hopefully I'll get a higher one because I know the code works on the Revive Out Lash products and the Hair Enhancer and the Brow from Grande Brow and Grande Lash. I meant to tell you early on, I do not have on any makeup, any sunscreen, any moisturizer. I've still just been wearing my bare skin and I've been doing, I've been happy with it. And I'll tell you, there's something I'm not liking and it just all depends on how you watch videos. When I bring, when I watch videos, I either watch them from my TV or from my laptop. And when I bring it up, all the people I'm subscribed to are on the screen, but they have shorts mixed in with all of them. And I don't enjoy shorts. I, you may, but I don't enjoy them because of the way I watch them. I mean, you have to click on them and hide them if you don't want to watch them on your on my laptop. And they're on my television also. I love it that I can give the thumbs up though from the television. I just found that probably about a month ago. I, I always would go back to my computer and look at my history and to make sure I gave somebody a thumbs up or left a comment, which I haven't been doing as well as I used to on the commenting, but I'm still there. So you won't be seeing any shorts from me and I'm not gonna be on TikTok and the only time I'd be on Instagram, I think, would be uh, if I need to get some information to you. If you are still here, this is going to be a giveaway. And because this is a giveaway, I cannot reply to comments. But as you know that have gone to older videos or the, what last week's video, any video, if you have a question, you can go there. If you have a comment, whatever, and you know I'll get back to you. And what I'm going to give away... This is kind of a celebration giveaway. I recently reached 35,000 subscribers. I had been at 34,000 for almost a year, since March 2022. And I'm really never been about big numbers. You know, of course, I what I look at the most are how many thumbs up and how many views. And, and, and I've not been concerned about my numbers. I don't want companies to send me things, so my subscriber amount doesn't impress anybody. And I will tell you, I think you know this already, but I have never purchased one subscriber or one view. A couple of you have asked me about the thumbs down. You can give a thumbs down, but nobody sees it. We have no control of the thumbs down. It used to show all the time. Now they've done it so no one sees it except for us. But the thumbs up I have control of. So, so I won't ever turn my thumbs up button off because I appreciate every one of them. And BK Beauty, that is the only person that I allow send me anything and all the rest of them go to my spam <laughs> except for BK Beauty. Risa does makeup, did a line of false eyelashes and she did four different ones. I'm going to go ahead and put them in here because she has four entirely different types of them. And one of these days, I'm going to put, when I get my glue, I'm going to put them on and have you watch me. But I know I'm not going to use all of these. But I wanted to congratulate Risa. Here's a picture of Risa right here. And I want to congratulate Lisa. Risa and Lisa. Lisa J owns BK Beauty. So, so I really have five different giveaways. Last time when I gave away the BK Beauty brushes, both of the winners got back to me very quickly. I had some issues with going to the post office, so I emailed BK Beauty to see if I could buy another box and have, have them send it to the UK for me. And they said, no, we'll, we'll give them to you and we'll send them for you. One of the things in my giveaway is going to be that core brush line. These are mine, these brushes, these are my favorites. I just absolutely love anything that's shaped like that. Just anything that's shaped like that. I, I love everything about these brushes. There's five face brushes and four eyeshadow brushes. So one person is going to win the brushes. And then I'm going to, since I have 3,500 subscribers, I'm going to give three $100 either e-gift cards or deposits into your PayPal account, and then one $50 e-gift card or deposit into a PayPal account. And how I always do it is I want you to write a sentence and the words are gonna be brushes, 
or money, either one of those. As the person's name comes up on Random Comment Picker, the first person will get what they mentioned first. So if somebody wanted the brushes, they use the word brush before the word money. And if you'd rather have the money, you say you use the word money first. And so I'll, as, as they come up on Random Comment Picker, the first three people that have used the word money will get the hundred and the last one will get 50. Just, I want to do it because I have 35,000 people. 35,000 of you press that button and wanted to subscribe to my channel. And that that's, that's really something. There's no towns around us that have that many people in it. And I always announce the winner in my next video is how that works. And it it is all good. I appreciate you. I Thank you for hitting the button to watch my video, and I'll see you in my next one. Take care. I never expected to play basketball all on repertoire of either. <laughs> Won it, oh, I won't ever shut my thumbs up. Thumbs. And I'll tell you something I'm not pleased with. And when I went to, I don't like doing that.